Tom Mesco may be one of the best punters the team has ever seen. But it's what he does off the field that makes him really important. Spend five minutes with him and you'll know exactly what we mean. Sultan, you often joke that you and Sebastian Vollmer are the two immigrant players on the team. So tell us a little bit about your childhood and do you think this experience has led you to giving back so much with your time in charity? A lot of my foundation and uh, motivation uh, comes from uh, my, my past. Growing up in Romania, having it be communist uh, un up until 1989 when the people rose up actually on Christmas Eve. We were lying down on the ground on Christmas Eve while bullets were flying through our apartment. Uh, having that, I kind of know what I've survived. The economy uh, was so bad in Romania. Both of my parents are engineers, uh, mm -hmm. making $100 a month back there. And uh, in 97, we won a green card lottery uh, where 20 million participants uh, won, so 55,000 people won out of 20 million participants. So I feel very lucky to have overcome those probabilities. This fall you were honored by the Patriots Charitable Foundation with the Ron Burton Award and it's for all the work that you do involving the Patriots Foundation itself. What would you say is one of the more outstanding events that you enjoy doing? Just there's so many a plethora of events that we do and you know the Patriots Charitable Foundation over the past 20 years have donated uh, upwards of a hundred million dollars to the community uh, to make a positive impact in it but I think the biggest part in it is involving the players uh, right. because uh, we have such a uh, human capital kind of impact on the community that you can't put a price on it. You're about to receive another award from the Boston Children's Hospital. Now how did this relationship develop? Uh, Children's Hospital Boston is uh, and you know Hasbro and Providence I mean those are state-of-the-art facilities, uh, right. hospitals that you can uh, visit, but it's, it's the kids that, uh, you know, you want to cheer up and, you know, light and their day up a little bit. You're so good with the kids. I mean, specifically, what are some of the things that you've done? You know, I've done so many things. I'm a goofball at heart. One time, uh, uh, this little kid, um, he was playing a Spider-Man game, and he couldn't beat the boss, like, 15 times in a row. And I was like, okay, this time, if you beat him, I'll give you 20 bucks and he outright beat him so bad that I thought I was getting hustled, so I had to pay up. During the off-season, you have developed a fundraiser called the Zolioki, a.k.a. Karaoke, and yeah. that benefits your foundation. So tell me a little bit about that, and um, who do you think is some of the teammates that you would say has the best voice? I mean, it's for a good cause, and, you know, the money uh, this year went to the Boston Children's Hospital. Okay. And it was, um, you know, just... About 35 players uh, showed up for a karaoke, and we had about 600 people in the crowd uh, that were cheering us on. And I don't want to throw anyone under the bus, so I'll take the blame for worst voice. I, know. <laughs> I thought about asking that, but yeah. I was going to behave. Um, what about best on stage performance? Um, that goes to Gronk. I, I think he oh, just figures. He, yeah, he just takes the he takes the cake with that. Yeah. You faced a lot of good returners this season, such as Peterson and Thigpen, Washington. Mm -hmm. Who do you think was the person you would least likely to face in the return? I, I trust in my coverage, I trust in my blocking, and I have a great snapper in Danny Aiken. Um, so we, you know, we work as hard as possible to, right. to face the, the opponent of that week. So there's a lot of returners out there, but you can't fear them. You just got to respect them. When I first met you your rookie year, I have to say, you did a great Bo Rat impersonation. Oh, Dad, geez. do you still have a little bit of that in you? I still do, and that was kind of my transition in the locker room to be accepted. And uh -huh. <laughs> one of my rookie things I had to do, but I still got it. I still got it. It's one of my uh, hobbies. <laughs> okay, so a um, little Bo Rat impersonation here. Well, it is very nice to be interviewed in the stadium of Gillette. <laughs> I love it. With the beautiful background, a yeah, little snow Yeah, back we ordered here. a nice little snow. <laughs> um, well, before we wrap it up, how about you say um, thank you for watching Style Boston in Romanian? All right. Mulțumesc că ați venit la Style Boston. Thank you. Yeah. And thank you, Zoltan. Thank you very much. Enjoyed it.